guys, it's Kumche! And Telfin. Yeah! Alright guys, here we go. We are on a blind reaction. Tower of God. We had a lot of requests for this. This also was made from a webtoon manhwa. Yeah. Korean manga, Korean anime manga mm -hmm. is called manhwa. Manhwa. Not, manhwa. not webtoon or manga. Yeah, manhwa. It's animated in Japanese, so this, we're gonna get all the whole shebang in this. All right, yeah. so cool, awesome. We're going to be going in a blind reaction for Tower of God. Thank you so much for joining us. Tofu, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's go. Whoa. Ooh. What do you desire? Desire a monster? Whoa, that's a lot of shoes. Damn, that's your dream, huh? Nah. That's yours to have a sweatpants? <laughs> I can't wrap my mind around it, but that guy sounds so familiar. This Leviathan. Whoa. Oh, I just ate him. Climb the tower and everything will be yours. Whoa, so if you get to the top, you pretty much become a god. Or you, you can get any wish granted. So it's about a boy and a girl. Rachel and Bam. Oh wow. What the hell? This this makes me wanna wanna dance. Yeah. Oh, this, oh. Really good. this reminds me of K-pop, but this is J-pop, right? This like K-pop? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, bust out those moves. I'm gonna dance to the to the way up to the Tower of God. Yeah. Wow. And then your wish will be to be the supreme dancer. The supreme K-pop. Yeah. Wow. Oh my god. Come on, babe. You gotta dance. <laughs> Woo! 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 Damn. Okay. The intro's fire. Mm -hmm. I like it. Bam. I'm sorry. Whoa. She's climbing the tower, so she's leaving guys, him. Yeah. So she's entering the tower right now. Oh yeah. Wow. Whoa. Wow. Weren't they running parallel? The, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Whoa. Damn. Oh. Whoa. It's like grab Yeah, it's like grabbing him into the tower. Or or the entrance. Yeah, taking him in. And these must be the gods. It's like Zeus. Zeus. Yeah. Look at that sound. Hedon. The rabbit snake, Hedon. The caretaker of this tower. Creepy looking rabbit. <laughs> Damn, so this guy is basically uh, in this Tower of God when he didn't even, he wasn't purposely going into this. No, he just wanted Rachel. There's, and then there's Leviathan. Can we just see him get eaten at the beginning? Yeah. The white steel eel. Okay. Oh, wait. You can actually go back? Marvelous. Oh, what the heck? He just kicked him in the space. Yeah. She left a footprint. <laughs> They're not even speaking. Japanese. Oh, a different language. Yeah, it's a different language. Wow, ah, so the thing was a translator. Whoa. Irregular? So, so the lost, huh? Irregulars are people that are not invited? I guess. But he didn't even choose to come in. He got pulled in. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, so this is a high level monster. Level 20. 
Just because he's cute. <laughs> Damn, this guy has no fear. This girl is a princess. Ah, Princess Yuri? She's part of the royal. This must be like their uh, wow. traditional weapon. Yeah. She's got a ton. <laughs> Again with the cute, attractive face. Yeah. <laughs> I like how confident this guy is. Yeah. Like, bro, there's a level 20 eel steel in there. <laughs> this girl is so tall. Yeah, yeah, she is tall. Yeah. So she's just doing it for entertainment. Mm. That's a fat belly. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yep, and then bam. There. GG. Whoa. He did the right thing. He's cutting oh. from the inside. The from inside. The, yeah, from the inside. Oh yeah. Cut the tongue off. Overcoming the fear of death is the answer. So there's like strategies and like ways to defeat monsters. Oh wow. Oh. What? He's too weak? How? I thought this was the test. <laughs> I, I thought so too. That rabbit thing is smiling. Heck. Is this what he Those look like the sword that he cut. Yeah? Right? So that means is he breaking the ball? That there he's in Oh wait, hold on. She's in here. What the hell? I'm I'm like so confused here. <laughs> that must be him. This must be a past that he's thinking about. Right? Yeah, so she's climbing to see the stars. And he's Bam, then. That's, that, his name is Bam. So that was him before, because they had the same eyes. So it was him before when he had long hair. Yeah, and they have the same voice. I swear this rabbit just wants him to fail. No, I don't think so. I like her backpack guy. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Damn. Wait, so the sword is not supposed to lend anybody strength or something? <laughs> what the heck? Even her, she thinks she's he's such he must be really cute. It must be because she like guys or something. <laughs> oh yeah, probably. Yeah, that's... <laughs> be gone! <laughs> be gone, Wyman! Oh my god. Power, superstition, what? They prefer men over women? He broke it. Oh! And he's gone. <laughs> next floor! He's already to the next floor! He's already, yeah! Yeah, so she just wants to have fun yeah. with all of this, huh? And the reason why she looked at him was because he's an irregular. Whoa, he just killed it in one shot. He just killed it, Whoa. yeah. What? So is he gonna go watch too? Oh, wow. So they're in like a different time. Either a different time zone or just because they're going through this tower themselves. Things might change. And we don't even know if she's gonna pass all of them. That's true. Or him. <laughs> <laughs> just... Why did he eat that? <laughs> this is cool. Regulars? So that means there's a lot of people in here. There's 400 regulars. Dude, this is gonna be something like Hunger Games. Watch. Oh my god, yeah. Reducing it to 200. Yeah. Oh. Oh. 
these guys look so yeah unique oh my gosh this guy's gonna die i don't know how this guy's gonna survive it's okay he got that sword with him the black mark do you see oh my oh, gosh dude. <laughs> dead. GG. yeah that guy looks too big that guy's humongous <laughs> oh my god he's huge <laughs> Wow, it's like a giant. Oh, oh, arrow. Oh. Another arrow. Oh. oh. Other people, like you said, Hunger Games. That Hunger Games, right? Katniss Everdeen. Oh my Everdeen. gosh. Dude, she's he's here. Next. Katniss Everdeen's here. Oh. oh, oh, oh wait, she's dead. Oh my Shield god. Arrow. Oh my gosh. Dude, what's up with this oh. OST, man? Already down to 289. How the heck did he just stop him with a briefcase? Man, that guy must be strong. Or his briefcase is strong. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shoot, what the hell? Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. Why didn't that guy kill him? Lizards. Weapon. Her weapon! It has the red eyes, like the Black March. Oh. So she has, she has one of those weapons too. Oh. oh, that guy killed him. Wow. Oh, my Oh, gosh. he showed up too. Dude, three verse one. He's just dancing with death right now. Yeah. Wow. This is, this is actually good. Yeah, it is. Wow, this is interesting. I really like the concept. The story of this character basically has to climb the tower. And they will be granted any wish, whatever they desire, right? Yeah. Revenge, riches, whatever. Anything. You anything. And what we see is that the main character, he's chasing after his uh, girlfriend. It looks like his girlfriend, right? Yes. Rachel. But the difference between him and Rachel, it seems like that Rachel wants to go to the Tower of God. Because she wants to see the stars. But he just wants to go because he wants to be with Rachel. Be with Rachel. That's right. So that made him... Become an irregular. Yes, because he didn't, uh, he didn't want to go to the tower. He just, he doesn't want anything from the tower. He just wants Rachel, whereas Rachel wants something from the tower. She wants something from the tower. So Rachel will be considered a regular. Do you think so? Because she doesn't look like she has special powers. Right. Well, but then a lot of those people don't either. What do you mean a lot of people? I... Those, all those guys in there look like freaking lizard men. The one girl has a the True, black they, march sword. True, they all they're all like different looking. Yeah, and it says something about like well, you have to be invited to the Tower of God or something. That's how you're a regular. That's how you're a regular. But the thing is, we saw a hand. Grab him in. So it, I feel like he was invited too. So I I don't know. I think it has to do with since he doesn't want anything from the tower, where other people want something from the tower. That's the thing that makes him different from other people. Yes. And I think what makes the difference between that is that maybe these guys are very interested in him, uh, the caretaker, right? Mm -hmm. uh, the royal. Well, well, maybe it's just because he's cute, but they're, they're probably interested in him because everyone else comes here solely, specifically for the tower. Yes. Something from the tower. Something from the tower. Whereas him, he's not here for the tower. So is no. that why he? It was easy for him to pass the first stage. Is because that he don't care about getting up the tower. The only thing that passed his fears are is just his desire to go go see Rachel. Yeah. To be he with has, Rachel. He has no fears right now because all he wants to do is see Rachel. See Rachel. He doesn't care. It's like he's oblivious to what's going on. He just wants to go. That's what makes this guy very very different from everyone else yeah and that's the thing we're going to be seeing here that's that's cool man that's really awesome and maybe is that why the caretaker just gave him a level 20 maybe from the start he was just like but because the royal well, he did give him the the rabbit the guard he did tell him either you can go against this and take the test or you can just leave so uh, he yeah, didn't have right. to die he said, you don't have to die because death just awaits you with this. Exactly. So either you can take this test and have the chance of dying, or you can leave without dying and not he, That's worry. right. He did give him the option. He did give him the option. Yeah. But once he decided he was in, that was it. And he passed. The, <laughs> and luckily, the princess was there and gave him that sword. Gave him that sword. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, dude, what if this guy didn't have a sword? And what was he going to do? Yeah. he Then he would have died. But he already knew that... Getting eaten by the eel. Yeah. 
That was the way? But I think that's why the guard said, what an interesting um, meetup or something. It's because, like, everything just fell into place perfectly for this boy. Ah. Right? Well, we're, we're with the princess coming in and everything? Yes. Ah. And then she gives him the sword. Which and also, then the yeah. sword accepted him, too. Exactly. Which the sword never gave the princess her powers. Yes, because it seems like the sword is biased. And then the... Sexist. Sexist. Yeah. Yeah, sexist. Her little bag boy was saying is there's like some superstition in the tower. And then mm-hmm. the princess got mad. I wonder it has to do with something like girls shouldn't compete in this or what? Well, but the thing is, remember we saw the lizard girl. Yeah, we did. And she had the sword. Yeah, but then you remember uh, the princess was saying there's more princesses of something. Oh, so oh, so that's a ro- that must be another royal then. It, yeah, it must be another princess. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, they're after them because they have the weapon. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. So that's these weapons must be a very high value. Well, obviously it is a high value weapon. I mean, that weapon literally came to life. Yeah, <laughs> right. It did. That's yeah. insane. It's like your uh, stand. What summon. Is, summon. Yeah, yeah it's summon. like a summon. It's like a summon. That is true. Yeah. The the music goes along with it very well too. Dude, the OST is. Really, 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 really good. I mean, yeah. um, you know, there's a certain parts where I get like a little bit of Requiem of a Dream vibe, you know? Yeah, yeah right? Yeah. You know, like a little Requiem of a Dream vibe. And the animation, it, it, it's a little different, right? It's, it's re- Yeah. But it matches. It does. It matches. I have zero problem with it at me, all. Same. I've heard a lot of mixed reviews telling me, uh, people telling us about like, oh, it's uh, the animation is different and stuff, but. Honestly, it fits perfectly. I love yes. Devil Man Crybaby, and the Devil Man Crybaby animation is completely different from this yeah, too. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. So I think other than that, I think that that's uh, very, very nice. Uh, one thing I did, I was a little bit confused is the whole ball thing. Oh, the ball. Yeah. So that was really interesting because he was breaking the ball. He was stabbing the ball, right? Yes. And after he stabbed the ball three times, when the when his old self, his long hair self, was looking up on the roof. The roof had the exact same three yeah. stab marks. It did. Yeah. It did, but then it shows Rachel is the one that's breaking it open. So it's like, I feel like it just has to do with his past, and he's just remembering what happened in his past as he's stabbing it. And he's no, he knows what she wants, mm-hmm. and she was there to save him, so now he wants to just be with her or something. Okay, so... That was more of a flashback, right? I oh, think it is so. a flashback because for a second I was like, "Wait a minute, that guy." It it looks, looks like it, the, yeah. Yeah, is does their time and space somehow like match up, intertwine? Because what it said also was that the time that each. Yeah, I think it's just talking about the time that they're going to be spending in this tower is going to be a long time. So by the time that they both get to the top, they're probably going to be different people. Because of everything that they're going through to pass these tests. Oh. So whether they reunite and whether they want to still be together at the end, it might play out different because of what they went through. Oh, okay. So it's not like they're living in different time and space. It's the fact that these guys, this whole tower game itself is very long. So what they're saying is that, bam, and for Rachel to meet, it could be the next 10 years. Who knows, right? Yeah, we don't know how many years and then just how much of the life that they give just to get to the top. And it could change Yeah, it could change them because I don't know if they've ever killed people before or defeated people or all of this stuff. They're going to see a lot of traumatic stuff as well on top of it. Yeah, Bam looked like he he had no problem though. Yeah, Yeah. that's true. Damn. OP2, by the way. Ooh, I love it. Oh, shit, I just want to... M E D dance, yeah, mm-hmm. man. All right. Well, that was Tower of God episode number one. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We'll see you guys very soon for Tower of God episode number two. Till then, have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>